food scraps go in and sustainable energy comes out. At least that's the plan for the young enterprise group at Kaikarai Valley College, where six students are eager to play a part in helping Dunedin become a sustainable city. We would like to collect non-edible food waste and put it through what's called an anaerobic digester, which splits the food waste into a gas and a liquid. Um, this will reduce greenhouse gas emissions where the food waste is being dumped into landfills. The group's inspiration comes from an urban farm being developed on school grounds and it's becoming a reality with the help of technology teacher Peter Dodds. He says it's amazing to see just how much thought's gone into the idea. This group is a fairly special group and we got five senior leaders of the students within that group and they wanted a really big challenge for this year and they decided to put it all out there and go for something that's totally different that I don't think it's ever been done before at the at a secondary school level. Dodd says the students will leave school as finely tuned business people with the experience of making their own product. And with their secondary education about to end, the pupils are ensuring the project will live beyond their time in class. Because we are on a tight schedule and time-wise, we will only be able to use it in a much smaller scale. But we are planning on maybe letting the next Young Enterprise team at the school to continue with the project and develop that further and hopefully introduce it to the country. The group's awaiting the delivery of digester technology from China, set to sit within the school's edible garden. And once that's in place, the students will finally get to put all their months of theory into practice. Ruby McAndrew, 39, Dunedin News.